y'all um i had to come in and make this video um and this is not a shade thrown video or anything like that but i'm gonna say what the fuck is on my mind and don't come for me unless i send for your ass okay i'm telling you that shit right here right now i'm gonna make this video and then i'm gonna move the fuck on swiftly and professionally okay shout out to my brother from another mother justin j1232 okay so i'm on social media and i see a posting um from tmz by well it was via b scott um and it was uh, uh a posting from tmz of course you know the paparazzi runs into people and of course they ran into miss patty labelle okay and of course when they ran into miss patty labelle of course the first thing they were gonna you know ask her was you know talk to her about was this patty labelle fucking pie okay and they said, well, you know, I guess they were asking her what she thought about James. Um, I can't think of his damn name. And I'm, I apologize to you for uh, uh, getting your, you know, messing up your name. But everybody, every one of y'all, I'm pretty sure that's watching this know exactly who I'm talking about. Because I'm pretty sure every one of y'all probably saw his video. And Miss Patty, you know, like I said, I love her to death. Okay, I do. I love her music. I love her. I love her as an individual. But what I don't like is the fact that she said she loves him. But she... Is the, she is responsible for her pie's success. Now, let me tell you a little bit of something. I'm not discrediting the fact that maybe she was selling some pies, but I'm going to tell you this right here. Didn't no damn body that I know, okay, no shit about no Patty LaBelle pie. And I know somebody who work up in Walmart, and I'm going to tell you the honest truth. They said them damn pies stayed in stock. They stayed on the shelf. Wasn't nobody pick. You might see a couple of people picking up one or two here or there. But the fact that this shit didn't sold out to the point where the people who make the fucking, who, who got, got the goddamn sweet potatoes to make the pie, the simple fact that those people said that they ain't even got enough sweet potatoes to keep up with the demand. Okay, Miss Patty LaBelle. So I'm not trying to be funny, but that was some fucked up shit for you to even say. Simply because anybody who sits there and put your, granted you Patty LaBelle, okay, I get it. But anybody who sits there and elevates your status, just not your status, but, you know, puts, uh, push your product, um, uh, pushes it a little bit higher, you should give credit where credit is due. Social media is a motherfucker. I understand, Miss Patty LaBelle, you're a celebrity. I get it, I got it. But at the same time, you need to understand that bloggers, bloggers, people on, you know, that make videos on Facebook, social media is a beast, Okay. Millions of people went and bought them pies because of that man's video. Wasn't nobody checking for no Patty LaBelle pie. Let's keep it real, real holy field. Wasn't nobody checking for that damn pie before that man made that video. Because I know damn well, I probably would have seen your pie in the store and I would have walked right past the shit. Just telling the truth, okay? Now, I'm not sitting there trying to, like I said, I'm not trying to give you too much. But at the same time, we need to give credit where credit is due. And I want y'all to be 100% honest on this video. I want y'all to leave comments down in the comment section below. And let me know, would you have went out and bought a Patty LaBelle pie if this man had made this video? Did you even know about the shit? Okay? Because like I said, I know somebody who worked at Walmart. They said them goddamn pies stayed in stock. But since this man made this video, people come in there every day by the hundreds asking for these pies and they don't have them they literally sold out it, the day that man made that video and it started going viral people was coming in that store buying those pies by the 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 cart load by the buggy load okay i'm from alabama by the buggy load so for the simple fact that you say that you you don't you love him but the, your pie success is a you know is, is a you know basically um because of you that is so far from the truth because one nobody buying them fucking pies Tell the truth, Miss Patty LaBelle. I just don't like when people don't give credit where credit is due. I, I just don't like that shit. Because when nobody buying your fucking pies, and a matter of fact, because of this shit, people need to quit going out buying your shit. You can, people can get mad at me if they damn want to. Is the, is the pie good? I'm not discrediting whether or not the pie is good. The pie is great. Okay? The pie is probably one of the best sweet potato pies you will probably ever buy in the store. God's honest truth. Okay, it's probably one of the best pies you will ever buy in the store. But to be honest with you, wasn't nobody checking for them damn pies before that man made that video. And I just, like I said, I just like people to give credit where credit is due. Okay, because my video, the video that I made along, just to me, I never, I never in a million years would have thought that video would have got that many views. My video got damn near 60, well it got 60,000 views now. And most people that watching that video was like, you know what, since you didn't made this damn video, I'm going to go buy one of these damn pies. His video.
video got over 27 some million views. Lady, I'm not disrespecting you, but that is some fucked up shit. Because one, your damn pies wouldn't have been selling like that. Okay? I'm just, I'm just keeping the trivia a holy feeling. I don't like when people don't give credit where credit is due. Your pie success, the way that it's selling now, is is you you need to give that man his credit. Matter of fact, I said you need to give that man a couple of fucking coins. Okay, quit bullshitting, Miss Patty LaBelle. Y'all chime in down in the comment section below. Let me know what you feel about her saying some shit. I mean, like I said, granted she can say whatever the fuck she want to say, but I didn't know about the pie. I'm pretty sure you didn't know about the damn pie. Granted, it's just a fucking pie. It's just a pie. But the fact that this shit is selling out and we're supporting a black woman's business is what's really fucking me up. The fact that she kind of low-key throwed a little bit of shade. Comment down in the comment section below and let me know what you think about this. I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.